Zombies. If you're paying attention, you know they're coming for us. My name is Anthony, and I spend every waking moment training for the zombie apocalypse. I'm as ready as any man can be, but no man can survive on his own. So I'm putting together a dream team of zombie assassins to survive and thrive with me in a post-zombie world. Join me as I find out who else has what it takes to earn a place on my list, and who I will have to leave behind. I'm sucked, I'm sucked! This is The Z-List. Ah! If you want to survive the zombie apocalypse, you gotta be tough. If you can't deal with pain, then what's the difference between you and a stupid little baby? Recently, while on the internet, I discovered that women have a higher pain tolerance than men. I wanted to put that theory to the test. So I invited every woman I knew, besides my mom, to a nightmarish hellscape of pain. And since Cass couldn't change her work schedule for my training, I had an open spot on my list for one lucky lady. This week's trial, pain tolerance. This is like literally the worst part of my day, every day when I have to open the door. Yeah, get in. Oh, hey. Get in, yeah. Hi. Okay, okay, oh, no, oh, hey, hey, hey. Hey, oh, yeah. yeah, get in. Hi. Get in. Okay. Dude, what the f are you doing? So on uh, Lisa's Instagram. I told you, oh, women over in you, it's like not. No, just, I, I thought I was gonna. I don't, get the door's open. Dude. Get the door's open. Oh, can, can we just talk now? No, no. no. I, well, that didn't uh, work out so good. That sucked. Probably better off. Kind of afraid of girls anyway, so. Dudes, thank you so much for coming, ladies. I promised you guys a nice meal. I made like a whole spread. So you can kind of help yourselves. Anything you want to take, take it, but just do it quickly. Have a seat and uh, we can get started. Have a seat like as quickly as you can. But like take take what you want. Hi, I'm Anne. I've been friends with Anthony since we were five years old. I'm a little bit concerned. Hi, I'm Sarah. My boyfriend, Grayson. I didn't get one of Anthony's walkie-talkies. He made the list. I'm mostly excited to just like not hang out with these losers anymore. I don't want to be the only one who's not on the list. Hi, it's me again. Ah! I was just starving, so I texted Anthony and he's doing another one of those things. I'm Laura. We've dated strong words for a time. I have regrets. Dating in New York is really weird. Hi, I'm Amanda. I'm an addict. Taking a two-pronged approach to get out of a rehab facility right now. I'm hoping that maybe this can fill out a work order, cross my I's and dot my T's. So, ladies, thank you for coming. I hope you're as excited to be here as I am to have you here. Uh, does anyone have any um, uh, questions for me before we get... Started? Anybody want to take a shot? Hold on, we'll actually get to that. You know I'm all about fun, I'm a fun guy, and I respect women, like a lot. Well, I read somewhere that women have higher pain tolerance than men do, and I certainly believed it. And so I wanted to put you through sort of a series of trials, a pain tolerance test, and whoever wins that test tonight can actually make it on my list. So this is a big opportunity for you. Hold on, I might be making you uncomfortable, let me. Oh. oh. No. A lot of red flags. Before we get into the rules, I'm just wondering if any of you guys have any questions uh, for me um, about the list. If one were to be chosen for this endeavor, could it serve as an example of gainful employment? If you're on the list, then I'll do whatever you want. You're basically family, as long as you maintain a spot on the list. Then great, 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 yeah. great, great. Are there any like couple benefits? like? If your partner's already on the list. I know Grayson's on no, it. No, did Grayson tell you he was on it? He's not. Yeah, I mean, I He didn't that make didn't. it. He was very bad at almost everything. <gasps> oh, got coffee in his head too. I, you guys know that Lisa made it. So am I like judging? You're sort of like cementing your spot. Also, you said you wanted the food. Oh, did you what? say pain tolerance test? Yeah, no, nothing dangerous. More just I'm wondering if you have any questions like for me, like how I'm doing. Did you stop seeing your psychiatrist? Yeah, I'm healthier than I've ever been. I've literally never felt better. I'm intensely uncomfortable right now. That's funny, because I left the seat down. Anthony, why are we here? 
Yeah, okay. Um, I actually have a lot to do tonight, um, so I want to kind of hurry things up. I need you guys to get out of here sooner rather than later. As I already mentioned, I bought food for you guys, so once you have a snack, uh, you can get started. I bought quite a bit of... Is that James? Wait. Thanks for letting me in. No, dude, what are you <laughs> doing in here? How did you get up there? Well, did you hear me or did you see me? I saw you. Yeah, I was practicing my quiet walking. Are you serious? Yeah, yeah. I got up the whole way and... I'm actually gonna remember this. Um, yeah, good. you still have to get out. All right. Bye, ladies. Bye. See, I'll just climb back down, but uh, quietly, quietly. Yeah, yeah, good. Okay. Good work, actually. Hey, thanks. Yeah. Have a good night. Okay. Anyway, so as I mentioned, it's pain tolerance. It's a pretty simple set of challenges. First stage, barefoot Lego walking. Second stage, wasabi eating. And third stage, pretty obviously, an electronic ab belt stimulation endurance challenge. Whoever wins, and I have a point system, is gonna get a walkie-talkie to be on my survival team, and then I'll call you when the zombies come. Does anyone have any questions? All right, let's go. There's a starting line and a finish line, because I've already probably hinted to you. And the challenge is going to be who can get from the front to the back as quickly as possible with no shoes on. You have to not only be able to handle it, but you have to pick your steps carefully, okay? About a thousand Legos, pretty easy, right? Like, this isn't hard. I just want you to get from the front to the back. If you do it at all, you win five points. And if you're the first person to get across, because I'll be timing you, then you win 10 points. I don't really think any of that needs a second explanation, but I do have some really good news for you guys, actually, uh, something I've been working on. Um, I know that this might hurt, and so all of you can drink as much alcohol as you'd like oh, to dull the pain. Not at all. Um, I've got all the stuff that ladies love. Sweet vermouth, fernet, dry vermouth, chartreuse. You know, summertime and it's a nice uh, kind of floral arrangement. If you take a shot, you lose two points off your total score. Just know I'm keeping a tally. Okay, guys, first of all, I appreciate the eagerness. I noticed you've been drinking quite a bit. Uh, I hope you're gonna be honest about how many drinks you've taken, because I am gonna deduct two points. I'm taking this seriously. I need to make a really clear decision. Please just remember that it's five points if you make it through, and 10 points for the fastest walker. Are you ready? Okay. On your mark, get set, go. Wait, that was 3.4. It's totally fine. It doesn't hurt at all. Show up. No, like seriously, try it. It's fine. Huh. You do it all day. Sure. I, well, hold on, don't. <laughs> Are you okay? <laughs> it's like beyond fine. Can I keep going? Yeah. Okay. Okay. It sounds way worse than it is, honestly. Oh, so, yeah, it's fine. Do you still have your shoes on? I, wow, classic, classic Laura. Are you? Do you want me to do it again? I've been a nanny for four years. Walking on Legos, that's what I do. It's true what they say about women in pain tolerance. That was legitimately unbelievable. Anthony didn't even say hi to me when I walked in. This one's gonna be a little bit harder. This is atomic wasabi. Each of you has a spoon in front of you. I expect a healthy spoonful of wasabi. Put it in your mouths at the same time. I'll tell you when. Please, ladies, <coughs> take your scoops. Oh, God. Good. Oh. Pretty simple. 60 seconds plus, and you get five points. And the longest person to keep it in their mouth gets 10 points. Ready? <laughs> Set. Go. No. <laughs> well, no thanks. <laughs> Wait. Nine. <laughs> ten. <laughs> eleven. <laughs> twelve. <laughs> Did you? <laughs> oh my god. Did you swallow oh it? Honestly, the food is much better here than at the facility. Never mind. It's not true what they say about women. That was pathetic. I tried like seven teaspoons of that stuff earlier today, and I only hallucinated for 15 minutes. It's free buffet bingo night at the synagogue. I think I'm gonna go. My boyfriend Grayson told me we'd be slicing fruit with a samurai sword. This? This is f***ed up. 
First round went well, I guess second round, not quite as well. You all have five points, Amanda has 20. Fortunately, you can still catch up, and that's why I brought the third round, which is an electronic ab stimulation belt. When we started dating, he was pretty normal. It's 75,000 volts, and each minute that you keep it on is one point, so you can catch up at 15 why minutes. Why you do it? Yeah, show what? us how it's done. This happens with every guy in New York. Oh, yeah, no, I don't know. Like, yeah. I do it for you. I can. I will do it. Show it. Show it for I, Let right? me use the bathroom. Yeah. It jostles your tummy. Not the worst boyfriend I've ever had. I'll be able to do it. I just have to use the bathroom for a second. Okay. And also, just did you notice um, the new painting I bought um, over there? I don't know if you've <laughs> seen you it. You have that. No, it's new. Yeah, let's go. It's honestly kind of still went better than I expected it to. Next time on The Z-List, we shoot tons of stuff with bows and arrows and see who's the best at doing it.